We're here with Daniel Von Egges and Paul Belanzik after the Freedom 3-0 sweep over the Utah Stingers. And Paul, I mean, you were blocking like crazy. You were getting kills. Maybe your best game in the NBA. How are you feeling after that match? Inspired. This is a great team. I'm so excited to be a part of this group. I mean, as you can see, like when we're happy, we're playing well together. We're one of the most dominant teams in the NBA. It's a great vibe today, yesterday. Uh, I'm just very thrilled to be here and being with this group of guys who can really win a championship. And Daniel, you're new to the club, but obviously seen your fair share of volleyball. Yeah. How, how did you feel you kind of acclimated to the team today? Okay, so for me it's a different story. I didn't play like professional for two years. I was playing professional and now I feel like so happy to be here in the NBA to play in the professional game and happy because I'm playing with freedom. So I got a team that is a really good one. We we can play much better of course, but we are thinking about the championship, so I can be more happy to be honest. Well you got a uh a, a roof, a house on the former Olympian Russ Holmes. I mean, what, what went through your head when you got that block? Such a special game, right, to be on the same court with Russell. I mean, just a really a, a legend, right, of USA Volleyball. And, you know, this was very special for me to play against him and, you know, the respect. We've, we've had communication last year, and he's reached out to me. I've reached out to him. And um, there's, like, there's just a lot of love, and this game was very special to me. So I'm very thankful. And you had a huge celebration after, but you have that for most of your kills and your blocks. Yeah. Tell me about the emotion you bring to the court. Yeah, so I love doing that, right? It helps fire up my guys. I think that when I, when I get a big block and, you know, I turn around and try to celebrate, yell, we have positive emotion. You can see when we, when we start playing well, we have good vibes on the team. So um, my job, I feel like, is just to bring that positive energy, that good emotion, and, and, and help the squad that way. And Daniel, this is obviously a deep team. What do you think you add to it? We are doing great. Uh, and like I say, we are thinking about the last part of the tournament is the most important. It doesn't matter how well you do in all the matches, the most important is how you get inside the finals. So with this team, uh, we are thinking about that. We are focusing that. Uh, I'm happy for that. We are uh, a really good team. We are playing individual. I think we are the best one, but we need to, to practice more, a little bit more, uh, more games, uh, more communication with the setter. For example, for me, it's the first time I just met this guy last Friday, two days ago. But we are doing really good, to be honest. And I mean, this freedom team, no sugar coating, you guys are a bit goofy. You guys have got a bunch of clowns and characters on your team. How are you uh, settling in with these guys? Yeah, I like that. I have this. <laughs> I am also this kind of person. So for me, it's perfect. I prefer. I try every time to jog, to make jog with the guys, to have fun. But focus in, in the most important is the game. But if you enjoy the game, and you enjoy your team, it's going to be easier to get the target. Daniel Venegas, Paul Belanzik, thank you guys. Great thank game. Thank you so much. Thank you.